strength. And today I'm going to go over the Turkish Get Up tutorial. And for this video, we're just actually going to address the first half of the Get Up. I personally like to break it up when I teach people. I feel that too many steps can really confuse people. It's safest to work first three steps and then finish with the second half on another day. So, for this video, we'll be just working the first half of the get-up. Now, the first part of the get-up, the first step, is simply picking up the weight. So, what we do is we start off on our back. First thing we want to do is push our shoulders towards our hips. This is going to help to engage our shoulders and get our lats connected to our body. Then we're going to roll to the side. Bottom hand is going to grip the weight. Opposite hand comes over top, so for, for me, it's in my left hand, right hand over top, pull it into your chest, and then simply roll to your back. From this position, pressing the weight up, locking it in, tightening that lat. Opposite hand, which is my right, comes to the ground, right leg comes to the ground, left foot comes slightly outside the body. Then, our first move is to tighten our core. So we want to tighten our abs as hard as possible. That way, we can roll, cross our body, onto our elbow. Now, with this roll, we want to connect everything through our core. So we're going to brace our abs, tighten that. And if you're having problems with rolling over doing a sit-up, just do a couple rolls on your shoulder and back down. So roll onto the shoulder, and then simply all we want to do is initiate the roll, push the elbow into the ground. When we get into this position, we're going to pull that shoulder in the socket. Next position, come right up onto our hand, extending the chest in both positions. So we want to lock the shoulder in. So when we're in this position, sticking the chest out to a wide spine, keeping the eyes on the bell, and then we push up onto our hand and back down. Then with two hands, bring the weight down and roll it to the side. So if this is the first time doing a get up, I suggest you learn the steps with no weight, then add the weight once you're comfortable. 